smoke a banana and stay with a slam. Ride around my city, I went up on my ticket. Ride around the city, I'ma run up them ditches. Hey, clowns up all around me, they all up in my business. Can't let them niggas know, you know these niggas be snitching. If I go broke, I'ma do for me. Who gon' do for you? Use a joke. What we got right here today is the food. She. The dog. The up? boss hog. What's up? What's up? See, man. I just wanted to put you in front of the camera for everybody to see, man. We see you've been uh we see you've been dabbling in the trade of hard way scene. You know what I'm saying? Mm. With they they uh people might want to call you a newcomer, but mm. you just showing your own face. Yeah, for it's sure. basically it's basically what it, it basically what it seems like. For sure. So I, I just want to know what 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 do you bring to the Trader Hard Way? What what made you wanna start being with the Trader Hard Way? Even though it's 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 a name, but it's more like a family. Yeah. You, I'm gonna let you speak on it. Let you speak on it. Uh, I mean, it's kind of like like what you said, bro. You know what I'm saying? It's kind of like I wanted to jump out there on the platform myself. You know what I'm saying? And, Really just show show my face and who I am just as just as a person. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, I am Trader Hardware because I am affiliated with them. Right. You know what I'm saying? So I kinda I look at them as my little brothers, you know what I'm saying? Shout out Bill, shout out Skiz, shout out Young, shout out Ethan Book, you know what I'm saying? So it's kinda like I look at them like my brothers. So everybody be like, oh man, you be trade a hallway? I'll be like, nah, I ain't with trade a hallway. But I am affiliated with the type guys, shit. Bro. So you can say I'm with Trader Hallway, but when it comes down to music and being in the group, I'm not. I'm an independent artist at the end of the day. At the end of I the came day. Out the gate like that. Exactly. So it's kind of like shit. We just we all just on the same wave. Exactly. Riding the same wave, trying to go the same place. We just all got different levels when it comes to us being artists. You know what I'm saying? So we all bring a different type of energy flow to the table. Okay. You know? A lot of people ain't think I, a lot of people don't know like as me as a loco. Yeah, I, I yeah. know you as loco before though. Yeah, 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 you know what I'm saying? You've been on me there for yeah. hours, you know what I'm saying? Before I even started rapping. You know what I'm saying? More of just the loco. You know what I'm saying? Uh, just call me all top of names and that's the one I kinda ran with because that's the one I kinda really it just stuck in my head like motherfuckers be saying I know I'm always tripping and shit, so I'm kind of used to this shit, so Loco kind of feel like, I feel like it stuck with me, it fit me. So shit. I feel that. I just, just, I just took it and ran with it, bro. That's yeah. Right. Most people, uh, it's funny, it's funny how we get our names, though. Yeah, for sure. It's funny how we get our names. Yeah. Trade the hard way. Even though, even though, you know what I'm saying, you... You know what I'm saying? It might be they might be three, but it's like it's more. They'd be like, damn, it's only five. It's, it's five of y'all. It's five of y'all, right, so right, right. About it. Out of them five, two of us not officially trade a hard way. We just affiliated with it because we all big one circle. Yeah, it's you know the big saying? circle. So it's, it's just the affiliation. You know what I'm saying? That's what make a, a motherfucker be like, oh, you trade a hard way? Like, nah, I ain't trade a hard way, but they're my brothers though. And you are your brother's keeper. Oh yeah, you know what I'm saying? They, I just try to keep everybody together, keep the positive energy in the air as possible. And, uh, What's that over there, Sheik? Just keep on. I just ain't nothing but love, G. <laughs> I just try to keep it coach. That's all. Right. Try to keep my head above water. I fuck with you. I want you to see I fuck with you. You know what I'm saying? It's a lot of niggas that be like, oh man, with this music shit, especially with this music shit, man. I done, I done seen, I done seen so many niggas fake it. With a nigga, you know what I'm saying, in his face. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I fuck with your music. I fuck with you just because he there. He right there. Just because he there. He there. Just to, you know what I'm saying? I feel like that, that, that shit lame. You that, think that's a St. Louis thing? Or you just think that's like... Yeah, is it more like just, just the affiliation or just like some people might... They see, they see that uh, one person got more... They call it clout than another person, and they just want to kind of sit there and ride them almost. It's almost like a, yeah, it's almost like a handout. It's yeah, like a, that, that's, I feel like that's what most of these 
I guess that they were call themselves artists is all sleep this or not, but yeah. I keep it a thousand. I call it how I see it, you know what I'm saying? Like I ain't specifically saying saying no names. Like I said, I just seen multiple artists, you know what I'm saying, be actually had talent. But they just don't know how to present themselves. Mm. I done seen some artists, you know what I'm saying, it's, it's like me. They just not putting their face out there because they got something to prove. Right, right. And I done seen some artists that think they are artists. <laughs> and they ain't no. And your perception of your artistry is not showing me what you're telling me. Right, you think you this, but you not that. You know what I'm saying, but I just, you know what I'm saying, like I said, I keep that shit a hundred. I don't want nobody to feel no type of way about me. I ain't, I ain't no, I'm a regular person. Right. I'm a regular nigga at the end of the day. I ain't no celebrity, dog. I just keep it a hundred, cause I come with my own style of music. Like, like I done had a motherfucker tell me, like, I like your energy. I like your aggression, you know what I'm saying? Like, with the new flow in the music, you got a whole bunch of melody. I don't want to call it singing. I'll just call it melody. Because a lot of niggas, I know some niggas that don't sing. They are artists, though. But they like to use that harmony, that melody in their shit because they get a better vibe like right that. Better vibe off of it. You know what I'm saying? I get a vibe off of it too, but it really all depends on how you come on that level. You know what I'm saying? But other than that, man, I, I, I fuck with all, all St. Louis artists. That's good though, I fuck man. With all St. Louis, you know what I'm saying? For photography, film, making. Whatever, you know what I'm saying? I fuck with I fuck with everybody who actually trying to do something with their shit. So you the one that's trying to just basically you trying to keep the peace between everybody. You know I, I see uh I see a lot of the artists and I was talking to a guy today about it and they was they were saying that uh He was saying how come like, you know, Nike and uh 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 what's a what's a guy named uh Lil Tay and all them, why they didn't like Link up and make like a MMG or something like that. That's yeah. what the dude was. That's what the dude said, and I, I kind of looked at it like, damn. I'm like, I'm like, damn. That would have been. It would have been hard. That would have been, been sick. It would have been raw. That you know what I'm saying? Hard. And like, like I said, I fuck with all St. Louis artists. Like for real, for real, St. Louis got talent, bro. Like a lot of people don't know that, but but St. Louis got talent. I want. I'm talking about real raw talent. You know what I'm saying? You know, but it's just the violence that's stopping that talent being shown. That's it. You know what I'm saying? It's the killing. But other than that, what would you, would you, they don't. And honestly, I don't know why. Because it's simple, dude. You know what I'm saying? It's just, like I said, it's going with unity, man. You got to bring all this shit together as artists. Like, cause I be thinking, like, if I was a promoter, to promote anything, like I want to bring all, you know what I'm saying, artists to the to the table. Like, I don't care if you don't know this person, I don't care where this person's from, I don't care if you're a blood, you don't care if you're a crip, I don't care. If you're an artist, come to the table and let's all bring this shit together. Got to. You know what I'm saying? I ain't really looking for no, <coughs> no, uh, <coughs> no showcase to do no showcase, but I am looking for everybody to show their face if you really want to do this. Cause you gotta show your face. You feel like that's the thing that might be holding St. Louis back, the unity and the violence. But number one is the violence. Number one is the violence. Number one is the violence. You got little kids out here getting killed, kid. Like for real. Hey man, that should be making me feel some type of way. Cause at the end of the day, what can I do? I gotta watch out for me and my people. You gotta watch out for you and your people. So it's kind of like shit. I be wanting to speak up on shit, but I don't want person. Who gonna listen to me? Say so you just feel like that. Just I just feel like that. Who gonna listen to me? Who gonna listen to me? You know what I'm saying? I could I could talk shit all day. I could I could yell it to the top of my lungs. The main question is who listening? Mm. You know what I'm saying? Like bro, I can just shit get deep into what it is. I can get deep with this shit. You know what I'm saying? But I, and I feel like that's what's gonna make people fuck with me. Just off the fact, my nigga, I can give you a real conversation. Cause I can get deep with you. And straight understand what, what, what a motherfucker's saying. Right. But I be feeling like, can a motherfucker feel what I'm saying? Where I'm coming from. So that probably be the battle with everybody. Most Just people. wanting to be understood. Yeah. And I feel like we as people, if you're not understanding this generation, you know what I'm saying? Motherfuckers choosing the way they, how they live their life. 
you know what I'm saying, and you, you ain't gonna never understand it because you're not trying to or either you're not even, you know what I'm saying, putting forth the effort to even see what the next person going through for you to understand it. You know what I'm saying? Like, I could, I could, I could, I could probably be looking at you, you know what I'm saying, just be on some, and you can, I can go off your body language, you know what I'm saying, how you sitting right now, you know what I'm saying, you could probably be depressed, but you don't show it on your face though, you know what I'm saying, but I don't, like that's me, you know what I'm saying, like I don't show it on my face, sometimes I do. But at the end of the day, see, I just... So you'd rather just keep it on the inside than trying to portray your mess on anybody else or try to ruin the vibe type shit. Yeah, I don't try to ruin I try to keep my energy as positive, positive as possible. You know what I'm saying? So it's kind of like, it's hard. But see, who said it was going to be easy? <laughs> like, a lot of people don't think about this shit, man. You got to think outside the box. You're stuck in the box. The only way you can get out the get out the motherfucker is think outside think that outside motherfucker. Outside that motherfucker. Think about the only reason I, I I picked him. You know what I'm saying? As like my second one, is because I just feel like the type of music he make it be on some real shit. Type deal. I kept him. I I, I can catch a vibe to both of their shit. That's why I picked those two. I catch a vibe to any music, but if I catch that vibe, I feel you on any song. You put out there. I don't care if I, how your flow is or whatever. I, I catch that vibe with, with either one of them. You know what I'm saying? So shout out to both of them guys. I fuck with three problems. I fuck with state. You know what I'm saying? I fuck with TNN. You know what I'm saying? Vito Gang, all that. Shout out to all this shit. You know, I fuck with all the movies. You know what I'm saying? So that'll be my two top with my video. Who gonna shoot the video with you and uh, Betty yet? You get to choose one videographer. Your choice. I ain't even gonna. I ain't even gonna put a, you know, a choice on. Those oh, real shit. I ain't even said this because I, I fuck with the shit. I fuck with tour. I fuck with tour for them. Just out the gate because he young. He humble. I never met him. He humble. Yeah, humble young soldier. I fuck with him. Shout out to the productions, man. Shout out to that boy. Keep doing your shit, nigga. Your shit, that, that'll be one motherfucker. Like, I'm doing something good. If I got unknown people that never seen me or they seen me before, come up to me and tell me, yeah, bro, you hold. You did that. Yeah, bro, you, 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 you hold. So they give, they, they giving you your, uh, they giving you your just desserts. They giving you your, your props and your kudos. You know what I'm saying? And, that, and I want to look for it. Right. That's, that's one thing I'm never doing. I ain't looking for it. You know what I'm saying? But I appreciate you as an artist, man. I appreciate all the artistry, man. And I wish that I could. I know that it might be impossible, but it's probably not impossible to sit down with every artist and talk to everybody. Because sure. that's not impossible. I think it truly is possible. You can ask, like, I just like, I seen some interviews, you know what I'm saying? Where, you know what I'm saying, like, I could, I could, I could see on a nigga face, like, he probably don't even want to feel like being Bob. Type dude. You know what I'm saying? But he, he gonna, he gonna, he gonna do it. Just off the fact. He either wanted to do it or you want to do it. Either way it go, he still gonna do it. But you can tell him, like I said, in the demeanor, in the person demeanor, or a person, like you said, a person vibe, you know what I'm saying? Or you can hear it in their voice. They, you know what I'm saying? Like, in the mood for shit, some shit. But other than that, man, it's just, when it comes to music, I be trying to keep everybody head right now. It's, it's shit ain't easy, you know? Like I said, I ain't no Malcolm, and I damn sure ain't no, no Martin. I'm me, you know? I'm me. I see right from right, wrong from wrong. I'm me. Like I said, when you got kids, I heard that, because some got to change. Some got to change. I ain't perfect, my nigga. I did my, I did my dirt or whatever. I, ain't, I don't speak too much on it. Because it ain't supposed to be spoken. You know what I'm saying? But I'm willing to take whatever I did out here to the grave. I ain't got no regrets with nothing. You know what I'm saying? But some got changed, though. Like I said, we all got to come together with this unity shit if we going to do this music shit. You said you ain't doing enough Complain about what? I go get a bunch Me and my little bitch, we gon' run it up After I fuck, I go get some lunch And later that night, I go meet the plug We taking them down for all of them drugs If you ain't got bands, then you ain't the plug yeah.